Erin Hoover. Um, I am currently an independent con consultant for the hospitality industry. I most recently was with Starwood Hotels and Resorts for 11 years. I left at the end of last year when the Marriott sale concluded and decided to go out on my own and I do a range of different kinds of projects from design to consulting with startup hospitality brands to working with manufacturers who are launching product in the hospitality space and basically I just love exploring all the different aspects of the hospitality industry. My most memorable career highlight was a project I was able to finish shortly before I left. Um, the Sheraton Park Lane, which is a historic property, opened in 1920, had not been renovated for a very long time, and we were able to do an amazing renovation that really brought the property back to basically it's what it was, which was just a wonderful place. Um, got tremendous response, the press loved it, guests loved it, so it was really nice to sort of complete that part of my career and leave on a highlight of having been a part of the team that revitalized this really beautiful and iconic property. Any challenges I have are short term and really relatively speaking not that great. I'm lucky to be doing what I love. Again, I, I mean, I guess I'm sort of a, a glass half full sort of person. So challenges for the industry, I think, are, I mean, we, you know, we talk about it all the time. It's the proliferation of brands. But I think that sort of loses point of the real kind of challenge that we should all be thinking about, which is guest experience. I think we should get less caught up in sort of brands and segments and tiers and think about, like, what is the experience? And if we can focus on that, the rest of it is really kind of extraneous. Um, so I think it's about the focus on the guest experience and then also um, return on investment for the owner. In terms of the industry outlook, again, this, this is why I love being in this industry because there is so much changing. There's so many new products, new ways of combining hospitality with different things like hospitality and entertainment, hospitality and sports. Um, you know, sort of responding to the way in which people are traveling, which is different. So, you know, you've got families traveling together as groups. You've got, you know, you've got such a wide range of opportunities there. I think that the industry really has to be very alert and very focused on how lifestyle trends are evolving and changing. And it's like, if we can meet the needs of the guest, then we're okay. If we get stuck into copying and doing the latest hot thing because somebody down the block did it, then we're going to lose. But as long as we can keep our eye on what, what people really need, then we're in a good place.